Hello everyone. Today I'm going to read from a book called Edge of Meyer's Bible Stories book. This book was written by Elise Edge of Meyer in 1922. The copy that I'm reading from is uh, uh, 1963 by Warner Press and which is um, affiliated with the First Church of God where I was baptized when I was 20. I've had this book for over 60 years. And I was asked uh, to read on my channel that I do, to read some Bible stories for the children. And um, I remembered that I had this book. This, this woman um, has a little preface in the front of it that I says speaks for the um, for what she intended with these Bible stories. Remember, this was written in 1922. At its heart, the Bible is a story, a story of how God has dealt with His people and revealed Himself to them across the centuries. It tells the story of how He sent his son Jesus Christ to show us what God is like to live and die and rise again that we might know eternal life the simple stories repeated in this book cover the full range of Bible history altogether they add up to give us an overall view of the big story that the Bible as a whole tells when Elise Edgemeyer first wrote these Bible stories in 1922, she made this statement of purpose. In the writing of the Bible storybook, the author has endeavored to familiarize herself with the viewpoint of children and to adapt her language accordingly. With vivid recollections of the capacity of the child's mind to grasp and retain scripture truths, she has labored prayerfully and conscientiously to present these stories in such a simple, direct manner that her youthful readers will have no difficulty in understanding their teaching. The degree to which Ms. Edgemeyer succeeded in her purpose is attested by the fact that sales of her book are in beginning to approach the two million mark. This was back in 1963 when this person is saying this. Wherever Bible storybooks are known, the name Edgemeyer stands high. The new edition of the book uh, in 1963 and the revised edition of 1955 have not in any way departed from the book's original nature or purpose. Arlene Hall, graduate of Scarlet Hall College for Christian Workers, writer, author, and children's 
of children's material and mother as well is qualified to do the task of those revisions, which this is the 1963 revision. The publishers join again with Dr. Edgemeyer in her prayer that he, sh he who said, which is Jesus, suffer the children to come unto me, may in this book find a medium to draw them to himself. I think that's very profound because the children are the future of the church and um, how they are shaped. The Bible says, train up a child in the way that he will go, and when he is old, he will not depart. That's in Proverbs. But the truth of the matter is, Jesus said, unless you come to him as a little child, you will not see the kingdom of heaven. So this book, in fact, is for all of us. It is a refresher for the adults and a delightful story time experience for the children to learn about the Bible. So I hope you will come and I hope you will join me as I read these stories um, on, on my channel here. And I thank you for watching.